No way it's an Orin, bro. Rek'Sai? Rek'Sai versus Renekton? Yeah, I wonder how this matchup goes. I mean, I assume that Renekton has to rush healing reduction or they can't play. Okay, Maokai ban. I mean, Heng also plays pretty good Xin Zhao, but it doesn't look like amazing in this game yet. I wonder what Aki is going to play. I mean, Aki's probably better on tank junglers. Like, maybe it'll just be a rel pick for him. Because it feels like right now, if you're playing against Zeri and you have, like, no engage, it could be pretty hard. Oh my god, just Rookie just locks in. Yone just like that. But Lady, I don't hate it that much in this game, though. We know it's not that, bro. What is it going to be? Just a rel? I mean, Trundle could be a pick. I'm down with a Trundle pick. Three frontliners, three targets for a Trundle to ult. Cool. Let's get it, bro. I'm ready. I'm ready. A different draft. We haven't seen this. Rookie Yone just dropping it off, bro. Just drop it off the Yone. Respect. Who's better team comp? I mean, if you want to say, like, objectively better team comp, I guess it would be WE. But I think that, like, for the team that's playing it, I could see this being just, uh, like, a good game for NIP because they just have champions that they're really good at. Like, Rookie, historically, has been a really good Yone. A lot of people don't remember his, like, Yone picks, but he's had some, like, some bangers on Yone, bro. Aki has his ult back up, but WWE have really good vision control. They've lit up the bot side, but you can see that Fofo still... Rookie is just perma going in. So much now because Rookie is they're just tri-laning mid, man. What the hell? They're not being able to play around Fog of War, though. It's hard for them to find a... No flash on Hang. I mean, they could have pulled the trigger there, I think. I don't think they need to be so scared. I think Aki can just go. They just don't want to fight because they're afraid of Rek'Sai moving first, I guess. Which I guess is reasonable. Oh, ulti? Combo. Dead. Nice. First blood to Rookie. Let's go. I'm down with a first blood on Rookie. Okay. Rating? Bro, he's just mad at what uh, he's mad at Wayward because of what Wayward did to him last time. Go on him, guys! Come on! Wait, where was the stun, Shanji? Where was the stun, bro? Nah, rookie, rookie set him up, bro. He set, set him up, put him on a silver platter for Shanji, and Shanji just didn't pull the trigger. I, I think it's a really good fight. I actually completely disagree. I think this is like a really insane fight for NIP. I mean, Photic just lost his entire HP bar for no reason. If he didn't do that, it would be a lot better. But yeah, no, no Trundle, no Reconnell. It should be good. That's actually so bad from Photic because they want to fight this. Like, this is like probably one of the best fights you're going to get. Does Rookie go over? I think Rookie goes over. I mean, they have they have a portal, so maybe it's fine. Shanji? Oh, Shanji, that's not the place to be. Dominus that is not good. Shanji just died before any, like, he just walked into the whole team and died. Nice. Well, NIP didn't get a fight. Photic entered, and then Shanji entered. And now they're going to have Trundle ult and Rakan ult back up. So now they just win, I think. And just look how well they're controlling NIP. Now NIP need to fight without a top laner for one of the most important objectives. I mean, Fofo is mid, so it's 4v4 right now. They're trying to take. The fight because of that. Oh, they just get a pull? Nope. Alright, they lose two turrets mid. Oh, they're trying to pick Joe because Joe's no flash. Yeah, they got him. He's just dead. Go hard bot. I mean, this is like a pick. It shouldn't affect too much on the map. Like, Shaji should be able to push in bot lane. Oh, they're just taking it. Oh, it's just free free Baron. Nice. All right, we can't win. Yeah. Oh, Aki is trying to go over? Yeah, you're not getting this, Aki. Yeah, and that's with Drake spawning, but he died actually early enough where I don't think that it will be too hard for Drake. I don't, th I don't think that this is unfightable, by the way, for NIP. I don't think it's unfightable. They just need to get, like, position. Like, they need Shanju to go over, and he needs to be threatening stay. It's the only way they can win. He stole it. Alright, actually, it stalls out the game. Hey, they're just losing third Drake here. They can't go towards Baron either. They can't do anything. Look, they're just stuck. How depressing does this feel? You're five man mid getting 1v5 by the Azir, and they're just getting free third Drake, and you can't contest Baron either. You can't do anything because you have no wards. You can't TP flank. They have Mikhail's for the Sejuani ult, so you can't Sejuani ult. 
another one of the big it's so fucked up. Of this is it, All right, right, GG. Now they're just doing Baron. They're going to do the same thing on Baron, and you just can't play the game. You have no words. You have nothing you can do. Greg the queen of the void up against the Baron itself. I'm not sure this will be one way we win. Okay. Aki's just checking in. He's oh, insta dead. Gets a double knock up for the engage. It's too easy for WE. They just walk forward slowly and NIP falls. Yeah, it seems completely pieces. doomed. Like, if you play this type of comp, you need to get a lead on Renekton. And you need to be able to, like, flank. If you're just going front to back perma, you can just never win. This rookie gonna try some desperation play. Yeah, I mean, what can he do? Actually, unplayable. What happened to Shanji? I mean, Shanji, is, like, has never been a really good Renekton player. I mean, his champs aren't, like, super meta. And then, like... Oh! Nice from Rookie! Holy Rookie! Actually, it's actually playable now. Oh, keep on going, no? Don't you have to, like, try to fight this? Don't you need, like, a fucking TP or something? Oh, my God, Photic. Nah, there's no way they can get in him, right? There's no way they're getting in him 3v4. Wow. A zero is a problem. I mean, I guess they, like, can't fight, but I feel like the fight would have been better on the... I mean, maybe the fight is actually not better on inhibs. Maybe you're just completely inhibitors down. As they keep crushing in towards the base. <laughs> I mean, the only reason they got that fight off is because Rookie hit, had flash, and now he has no flash, and the carries both have flash, so it's like, how do you play? And Rookie's just one shot. Yeah, I think it's probably just over. Oh, maybe you get a reset on Wayward? Oh, man, if he got a reset, if Foda got a reset, he might be able to just smurf it, but nope. Can't play. Yeah, yeah. That's a WE game, bro. I think we need an Azir ban or we need an Azir first pick. Something like that. Oh, rookie? Oh, he, oh, he got he got Iwandi. Big. Damn, damn. Rookie said, get the f*** out of my lane. You Hail of Blades Janna bitch. So Shaji did Conqueror Ghost Tech. We haven't even talked about this. Conqueror Ghost Tech. I mean, he's somebody who always went uh, Ignite. Oh, oh, Shaji's just like that or what? Oh, he's not like that. Oh, okay, he's like that. Jesus Christ, bro, that was scary as f dude. If he had Ignite, he would have he would have sent it. But I, I mean, this is like how bad is this for him? Like he loses Cannon Experience. The other guy lost like what, like three, four minions. I think it's okay. I mean, the the reason why I feel like Shaji wants to do this is he forces the other guy to TP and then he doesn't have to TP. But um, yeah, Conqueror Tech is is, is different. Uh, first Udir, I know a lot of people go first strike, but I guess versus um Rexai, you try to like actually beat his ass instead of farming him. Oh. Oh, Shanji says that's my grub. Bitch. Respect. Kind of like it. Oh, I kind of like it. That guy's dead as hell. Can't play. I'm down, bro. I'm down. I'm down. They're scrapping. Rookie on Talia, bro, changes everything. He's able to do so much more. Oh, Photic? He's just dead? Oh, is it? oh my god, he's not? TP? Okay. Oh my god, Rookie missed? No, Rookie, we can't be missing that, bro. He was It was free. Nah, bro, that was free. That was free. You can't be missing that. Nah, this is not a play, by the way. I don't think this is a play. Nah, no, 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 there's no way, there's no way, there's no way. No way, no way, right? No way, it's just, it just like that? Wow. I was surprised. I don't know. I didn't think they would be able to just get it like that. Like, with no wave. I mean, they got the minion into turret. Fofo just tanked it like a psychopath. It ended up working. Dude, don't tell me he used it on Drake for damage. It's so criminal if that's the case. Stay is in trouble. He has no flash. He's dead. When you're looking for one beyond with the enemy mid lane, and Shanji TP's in, and Aki's here too. And suddenly, it's not a one. Wait, this takes the shutdown? Bro, I, I would rage. I would rage so hard, bro. No way we're giving him the shutdown. I would waste the Rumble ult just to get it on Shanji. Rumble's got to be careful walking through here. Oh, they're just sending it on stay. Nice. 
Oh god, this is cyber. John Jay is ghost. He's good. Alright, they're solid. I mean, they're solid. They're still up 2k. I mean, they had like a bad sequence for NIP, but they still look in control of this game. Like, <laughs> then your next thing was that game one match fix is so obvious. Wait, hold on. We got to fight. Well, oh, Photic doesn't die. Wayward didn't go for Photic. He actually went for Rakan instead. I mean, he cleaned up both. Rumble Ult is pretty good, though. They go on Jenna or no? No, they're not going. Actually, pretty good response play. They did this on the timer where uh, Joe didn't have ult. I mean, I think this fight should be good for NIP. They just need to wall them off here. Oh, they actually don't have wall for like 10 seconds. So maybe it's not good. We'll see. Rumble ult sections them off. They just go mid turret here. Zone them and go mid turret. It's not good that the enemy team got this, uh, Drake. They probably can't even get the entire mid turret, but they can get some damage. Good wall off. Maybe they can get the mid turret then. They get Hang's ult. Nice. Good play. Good play from Dro. Dude, I think that this series is just going to devolve into Rakan getting more and more and more prio. Until Rakan is just getting, like, first picked. Like, this champion is just so OP in LPL right now. Just kidding, it's Vettius. I don't know about this play. I don't like it. It's okay. I mean, we'll see. Oh, Aki went super deep there. Oh, good damage from Shanji. It's kind of scary, though. They get Hang. Oh, Photic? Does he have Flash? No, he doesn't. Oh my god. I think that kill would have guaranteed Baron. I'm not sure if they go for it. It seems a little bit scary to do Baron. Fofo STP is going to come back in. Mantra Qs are annoying. Oh, good catch from Rookie. I'm, I'm scared of this, bro. I'm so scared for this. I feel like it's really scary. Fofo ends up on the side of the wall he wants to be. Looks like they're going to get it. How many people get out? Can we get... There's no top turret. Decent, fl decent flash. Well played, well played. Get a reset. Okay, just run, just run, just run. Damn, bro. That was on the edge right there. I like it, though. Let's go, NIP. Bro, I feel like crit is such a weird mechanic. I just don't like crit being in League of Legends. I've went on this ramp before, but I'm just not a huge fan of, like, RNG things. It's like they didn't want there to be... Oh, Fofo's just dead as hell. So walking up to try to dodge the Talia, but he ends up getting smurfed on. So, obviously, people will, like, try to discredit it when, when you're, like... Like, oh, like, Dom doesn't understand draft when his, like, analysis of this draft is, like, oh, like, NIP is playing champions that they know how to play. Or, like, that they're good at. Which makes it better. But I actually think that that's how draft works. Like, unironically. Like, obviously, you can have a, co a compositional advantage. And, like, there was parts of this draft that I didn't like. Like, mainly the Nocturne, I don't think, makes too much sense in this draft. But, yes, literally, the fact that Rookie is playing Talia and Shanji is playing Rumble changes the draft. Like, being good at the champions that you actually play is important. And unless you're dealing with super elite teams that are ultra flexible, the draft is going to be better or worse based on if the players that are performing on your team have agency to do things within the game. Okay, Rookie TV behind. Oh, man, it's a combo. Oh, they stole it? Oh, Jules actually... I mean, it's kind of weird. Rookie's, like, sectioned off completely. His team needs to try to get to him. Do have another E soon? He's dead. Photic is trying to open up, though. Oh, the Rockets actually killed Iwandi. Oh, my God. State killed Iwandi. Photic is looking for Fofo. Fofo's dead. All right, all right. This game should be a wrap now. They stole the Drake and they won the fight. Game one could not look more different. Okay. Killing that guy too. Guess we just go mid. I don't think we can end. Absolute criminal. Okay, here's the engage. I want he can't play, bro. He just got cooked by Shanji. Uh, Fotik will just kill Wayward and he can run at everyone else. Shanji's actually unkillable. Wait, Shanji with the Rift Maker, and we crit those. Big. All right, we got a series. We got a series. All right, so now we have to see the adaptation because, like, Rookie Talia, I feel like he's just going to smurf most games. It just gives him too much agency in the game, too much playmaking, ability to move around the map. So I think the Talia should just be removed. 
Fantastic game number two. Ain't no way, bro. Ain't no way. Hang has played this before, though. Hang has played the Mundo before. Mundo, bro. Holy shit. Hang with the Mundo pick. He actually likes this pick. I think it's Tristana then, no? And yeah, Mundo is, is uh, Hang's specialty. He, uh, where did he... Did he play it this split? I don't know if he played it this split, but I remember he played it last split. I remember watching the Mundo game. Wasn't it, like, kind of terrible, but it ended up... Did it end up being a win, but it looked terrible? What ended up happening? He played it... Versus NIP he went 0 6. It was the split. Oh, it was at the beginning of the split. Yeah, he had the 0 6 Mundo game. Then he had another one versus AL where you went 1 2 and 6. Oh, he played it uh, twice in one series versus NIP. You know, since the rework on Mundo, I never played it one game of jungle. I completely gave up on it. I didn't even give it the time of day, so I have like no idea really how it. How it feels like I mean the strengths are still similar versus champion like Maokai. But you still just out clears Mundo. Passive is pretty nice into Maokai ult. Oh, the clear from, from Hang, he cleared all the way to top and then he came back for bot crab. Question is, does he go for a Raptors here? Respawn Raptors from Maokai. Yeah, he's gonna get double crab here. This is balling get dove as a result. Doesn't look like it. They have exhaust. Not that easy to dive. No mana on Photic, no biscuit. Hang got both crabs. Is he just gonna go Knight's Val like everyone else? Kindle gem? Or is he gonna go like some type of bombies item? Okay, Augie's down at camp. His camp that's up is actually the Gromp. It's on the other side of the map because he did a... People call a slingshot clear. It's the one where you start... Um, bot side. Do one camp, go to top side, and then clear back towards bot. They lose Drake, and they're not even getting grubs for it. Nice, well, well done by Wayward. You see how he's how he kept the tunnel in lane in the brush. It's really OP to do. People need to start doing that. Allows him to just avoid the all in. We saw BB do it yesterday. People have to start using the tunnel network in lane. It's the next evolution. Yeah. What's there to say about it, really? Um, any kind of sustain in top lane is problematic. To the point where Renekton, who's the other big um, kind of proponent of this, is like a trader of offside, actually. And that goes down. Not sure it's going to lead to much of a kill. But yeah, basically, and trading bot. Upside, it was removed from Renekton because it was too obnoxious. And then suddenly, Wayward comes in and is like, even at level 1, basically sits there and gets to get a free health potion per rage stack. Pretty much. And Photic moves into. Juo there, side steps left so Juo can get his damage in. Nice, doing work on bot. Hang is down here though. Hang is only level 5. No ghost, he has flash. Just here to relieve pressure. But they don't actually have to like, they don't have to respect the Mundo at all. Actually pretty nice for them to be able to do this. Stay has no heal right now. Do have to be a little cautious not to overstep this one, but just the amount of threat coming down here is okay. so obnoxious. Oh. Even canceling the cannon wave. Oh, man. W Starting to get a lot of pressure in the bot lane. That's the wave together. Oh. Oh. Okay. Oh, he got rooted. Damn. Ends up being first blood. Man, if that went to rookie, it would have been so huge. So even though Photic is in bad conditions, I think they still just want to fight it. It's 4v5. Iwandi is just chilling on the... The ward. Oh, Photic? Oh, can they jo just go? Just go, just go, just go. Nice. Yeah, yeah, he got hit. Oh, double bubble. Big. They didn't even actually need the TP. Lean. He alive? He's alive. And they get Drake. That is such a big play. Damn, they saw the Maokai root landed and Rookie just sent it. Big. I mean, Wayward gets pretty much the full top turret for that, but you'll definitely take this if you're um, NIP. It's so good for you, man. Just kidding. Oh, Wayward's tanking. Wayward's tanking. Oh, don't tell me. Is Hang a flash? Hang his flash. Oh, my God. Wait, did Wayward, like, Q somebody? Under a turret? Is that how he was tanking? I didn't even see. Dom, do you think NIP made their name because of that one Jay-Z Kanye song? Ninjas in pajamas yeah that's why they did it imagine that was actually their name their name was just the name of that song holy oh on taiwandi stay has no cleanse okay he ends up having to flash pretty good though pretty good it's a good play from aki like this is a great time so once again 
Look at the timing they just did this. We 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 talk about this all the time. Look at the timing they just pulled the trigger here. They're giving Harold. They know they're giving Harold, so they're not contesting like topside. There's two minutes until Drake. Now there's no sums on the bot lane, no flashes on the bot lane for the Drake fight that's coming up in two minutes. Just kidding. They fought for no reason. Only a Lucian that does physical damage, where everything else is magic. So he thinks that there's no need for Cleaver. It's not like Rek'Sai is taking over these games, so... Oh, Rookie has to TP back because he doesn't know where Rakan is. He knows Rakan is coming to his side, so they have to give the turret here. He's gonna get package for this... Actually, when does he have package? He has package in like 15 seconds. Oh, he has four seconds on package. He's gonna wait for it. I mean, bot turret for this. I mean, they don't have pressure on sides is the issue with their comp. I mean, if I'm WE, I'm not contesting this uh, Drake. I'm giving the Drake and continuing to play on sides. Oh, Rookie didn't take the package yet. I don't know. I feel like this is just a mistake to fight this, though. You're kind of fighting on their terms if you fight this. Like, Corky can just base for package after this wave. He's going to do it right now. But he has no TP. Kind of a late base from Rookie. I don't necessarily like it. I feel like he should have just pick up, picked up package the first time. Nah, Rookie griefed this. Now they have no package. How do they play? Damn, this is like a situation that was fav favoring NIP that they completely griefed. Maybe they can go towards mid, package them off, section them off and stuff. It's not a really important Drake, but I feel like it was just advantage them. Like they want to be fighting the Drakes because they were losing on side. They get mid turret for it though, so it's fine, I guess. But now Corky just has his package picked up for no reason. Oh, rapid fire procs. Damn. Okay, Photic. Oh, they're flashing on him? Oh, he tried to one for one. Yeah, he, he didn't use his flash, which is good. Did they lose Baron for this? Probably not. Rookie has enough poke. Rapid fire sucks. Rapid fire is OP on Lucian. <clears throat> oh, he flashed into it. Shanji, come on, brother. You're better than that. Shanji should have accepted. Like, the thing is, he's not going to get one shot there. Like, he should just accept being knocked back by the ulti. Or even sidestep the ulti, like, sidestep into them. And then flash afterwards, and he's good. He has CP, though. And they ended up using a zero ult. Um, which does matter. Photix getting some damage. But the thing is, Rookie doesn't have package because he f***ed it up last time. So now his package timing is completely off. I think what... NIP should try to do is like try to get a like a fight where they poke them and then just go Baron afterwards because they can't actually get the, um, the objective here. Iwandi is getting completely CC'd. Oh my god, he one shot him? Ain't no way, bro. No way. <clears throat> Stay is dead. Man, Rookie not having package for these fights is actually huge. Okay. <laughs> Maokai's coming. Can Rookie stop them? I think it's Fofo is dealing all the damage. He has flash. He's gonna have to flash the Rakan W. He's it's it's impossible, I think. I think he's just doomed. Maybe he goes over onto Fofo. They all just flash. Okay. <laughs> They're all just out. Damn. Baron for WE. Huge. I mean, Rookie just didn't have package. I don't know. Rookie just did not have package. Sucks. Okay. Package here. Trying to go into Wayward. Didn't get anything. Chanji has no flash here. This could be. Bro, I don't think the rockets on Mundo do anything. He knock on the door and actually see if they're in, or will he just leave it on the doorstep and take a picture? That Maokai ult did nothing, bro. Doesn't look like he'll do either for now. It he's actually nothing. See him on the map on your phone, but he doesn't seem to be. Oh, rookie tried was trying to go on to Fofo and he griefed it. Does he have to flash? Are they gonna go at him? Oh, rookie f***ed up his package, bro. Come on, rookie, we can't be doing this. There is no direction to the ult they're throwing out here. I mean. They've got ourselves a pick on bot side, but I don't think Wayward is... Wait, Wayward, like Wayward's just 1v2ing yeah, them. Rek'Sai, he's just going to start 1v2ing. Yeah, Wait. That one. Oh, I don't know about that. Shanji, I don't know about that. Oh, he gets a really good Q. Huge, 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 huge. huge. We got to help him. We got to help him. We win, we win, we win. Come on, NIP. They win this, they win this, they win this hard. That's two fights in a row that stay goes down. And now NIP grab a drink. Yeah, the dragon didn't follow the last confrontation. She okay. I mean, it's really fine because, like, the other thing is that they didn't end up using their Baron now. Like, their Baron essentially is timed out. They only have 800 gold Baron power play. I didn't see the rocket during all of the action. I was looking at Shanji. But you can never take your eyes off I don't think he W's this, bro. Don't W it. Don't W it. Relax, relax, relax. Let's clear the wave. 
You only have that's your last that's the last wave. That's the last wave. They're losing top turret though. But uh Shanji just hit bot turret tier two. Shanji needs to just hit the turret. But we're getting to the point in the game now where we're headed towards three items, and that's where He was late on hitting this turret, bro. He could have done work on this bot tier two. Could have got the whole thing if he wasn't worried. They're gonna lose mid though. Three seconds on this wave, damn. Oh, they're TPing to kill Shanji? Shanji got the turret, but I guess he's just dead? Oh, the TP was cancelled? TP was cancelled? Aki died for it, bro. Damn. Aki died to cancel that TP. He W'd Fofo there. Shanji survives because of it, though, so... I guess it's okay. Fofo's looking for an angle. They're looking for an angle onto Photic. Photic has flash. Joe has ult. Oh, they kill, they kill the enemy support as a... As a Reaction to it, it's fine. Just gets one shot. Man, it's Wayward once again being part of that real initiation to flank threat. The unseen submarine from the side. The rookie is starting to do damage, bro. When he hits 16, it's gonna be so big. Are they going towards Baron here? Give Drake, go Baron. I wouldn't hate it. Make them walk into saplings. Renekton can stay on a flank. And Renekton, I think, can one shot stay in this fight. Or he has package. He's on a ward, though, but he has package. Let's see. They're baiting them in. Rookie's missed every single rocket, though. Photic is just getting one shot, though. Oh, on to stay? Oh, Rookie just got nothing off there, man. Bro, his package did nothing. And then I guess, like, Shanji is just getting one shot by Fofo? Is the game just over? Are they just ending the game, or what's happening? Bro, the game's just over. They just lost. Damn, Rookie missed every single... Um... Mixed, missed every single rocket. I don't know. I mean, they just like, like we were just flashed on Lucian. It just ended. Okay. Yep. Yep. I like it. Keep on going. Yes. Yes. Red buff. Nice. And Rookie gets first blood. Let's go, Rookie. Then Ease gets the shred and then continues the trade. It's really nice if he gets it. Oh, Wayward actually griefed here. Oh, good flash. Nice. Let's go, team. Let's go. Oh, is he? Uh, he has phase rush. He has phase rush. He's not necessarily dead here. Okay. Oh, that's what we needed right there. Fofo, no flash. Fofo, no flash. No E. He's dead, too. Foda gets the kill. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Sean GTP for no reason. Absolutely no reason. He is completely griefing. For free. Wait, wait, wait. Stay just uses E. Does he have to ghost? No. Oh, maybe Red Buff will make him ghost. Yeah, I wanted to flash ult him back here. Oh, they're going on to Shanji. Oh, nice. He has no ult. He's just dead. Okay. Oh, they just pulled the trigger on Hung. Oh, he's dead. All right. Joe took some damage there. It's good, though. Enemy jungler's dead. Good trigger pull. I like that. So, Rakan, okay. So, Rakan won every game okay. True. Rakan did win every game. I mean, the dude, the, it just needs to be first picked every game or banned. The thing is, W is probably going to go blue side next game. We've seen, I think every game NIP has been on blue the entire series. So, we'll see. I mean, the thing about that is, like, I don't even know if, like, counter pick matters for NIP. Like, I don't know what they'd actually counter pick. I feel like NIP wants to be on blue side, so. It's kind of hard. They need to rex I ban. I mean, it's really hard, right? Because so far they've been banning what? They've been banning uh, Varus. Was it Va Varus, Tristana, Bard? So if you ban Varus, Tristana, Bard, like what are you going to give them? Maybe you give Stay Varus? I don't know. I don't know which one you drop. I don't think you drop the Tristana ban. Puffin's Tristana, even though it was really sus in previous series, I think you don't give him Tristana. I don't know. Wayward missing his ult now. Wayward. Rocket? Ooh. It's fine, it's fine. Just play for soul. Just play for soul, boys. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Don't start Baron. Don't don't do anything around Baron. Play around soul. You have soul in 120. You're really strong for the fight. You have sums on everyone. It's all good. Just play around the Drake. And like you can base early, bro. F top wave. F top turret everything over commit for it please you win the game if you get it oh photic is so strong here nice nice good you force his ult great by shanji great by shanji force kasante ult 50 seconds before drake he's not gonna have ult for drake now 
This is good. Everything is good. Dude, I feel like that's kind of an outdated narrative. I feel like NIP actually got better at playing around objectives throughout the season. Do we really need to... Alright, bro, whatever. Okay, okay. Is Hang dead? Let's go. It's a fucking wrap. It's a fucking wrap. We're so fucking Barack. Make sure they have a last hurrah at this one. Fofo, stay, I wonder. Sticking around to see if there is anything left to say, but it is a 3v5. What can they realistically do? Oh, look at this flank. Oh, okay. Rookie doesn't quite find the knockback. And Fofo trades back onto him, but there's no Three. smite here. For oh, we're flanking with... Oh, they're all dead, too. They stayed around. They're spectating, bro. They in the Sneeko chair in the corner. Just go towards these guys, bro. Yes, yes, yes. It's over. It's so over. It's so over. They're shitting their pants right now. GG. Okay. Okay. Okay, rookie. He's got the lineup. Oh, the flash misses. Doesn't fucking matter. That's my goat. Feels like a bit more of a Frodo because it feels like he's playing with nine fingers at this point. Oh, he killed that, bro. Fodix on one. All right, relax, Fodix. Relax, bro. Just end the game, please. You're scaring me. Away from my Wandian way, but they've managed to find the way under W skin. That's not going to be another frozen treat for NIP as the ult goes wide from our keep, but they still have themselves. A push oh, oh Fodic. Oh, okay, Lens. Fodic took a good chunk of damage there. It's GG. Really I want these one shot. And he still survives. Aki keeps them away as I want Kill threshold should be at like, it should get to like 22, maybe 23 kills max. Yep. Yeah, this is a this is a absolute whitewashing here. I mean, Fofo played it pretty much as well. They could actually rookies dying. Oh my God! Wait, what's happening? What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? Wait. No, 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 bro. There's no shot. They overly committed onto Fofo, bro. Not the first time we've seen Italia interrupted, and now Rookie won't be here for the fight. Going down. You gotta hit this, Aki. You gotta hit it for the boys. One time, Aki. One time. No. They still win, but like, god damn, bro. How did this even happen? They just let like Wayward just one shot Rookie. Okay, Global. I mean, look at Jinx items, bro. How is it losable? How can the how can the Zir out carry a Jinx with these items in this fight? Like, how is it possible, bro? It's, there's no way it's possible. I mean, the gold I mean, to be honest, though, like, I think this Jinx needs an LDR. I mean, Elder's still on for 50 seconds. They're going to force Baron here. They're forcing Baron. Wait, you're TPing here? They're going to lose Baron. Because they're, I mean, they're going to give Baron because the enemy team is Elder? Bro, we really are just giving it to? What's happening? I mean, they just didn't want to lose versus Elder. I don't know, bro. I don't know, man. I don't know. Bro, we need an LDR on this Jinx. We don't need a rapid fire cannon. We need an LDR. Please. Please build an LDR. And then sell your shiv for a rapid fire if you really need it. But we need an LDR, bro. Look at the Cassante. No flash on Aki. No flash on Aki. He's just dead? Or what? Oh, he's alive. Rookie flashes out. Oh my god, bro. Oh my god. What am I watching? There's no way. This would be the most tragic thing of all time. No way. No way. No way. No way. It's actually impossible. It's actually impossible. Wait, is the game over? Do they actually lose? There's no way they lose. There's no way. Wait, they actually lost. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. This is like the most ridiculous throw I've ever seen in my entire life. Nah, no way, right? He kills Wayward and then he bases. They can probably... Oh my god, bro. There's no way. This is just such an impossible situation. There's no way they could ever lose. Oh, can they pick Fofo here? If they pick Fofo, it'd be huge. Oh my god, they're gonna do it. They're gonna do it. They're gonna do it. Doesn't matter. He's still dead. Right? He better be fucking dead. He better be fucking dead. Let's go. Wait, is the whole team up here? Is Rookie dead? On to stay? Oh, okay, he has GA, he has GA. Where's Fotik? Where's Fotik? Where the hell is Fotik, man? Okay, he, can he carry this? He can, he can, he can. Let's go! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Frontline, 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 frontline. Please, 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 please. Yeah, he's got it, 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 he's got it. Thank fucking God, if they threw this game, I swear to God, I would freak out. I would freak the f*** 
fuck out if they lost this game. This would have been horrible. This would have been absolutely horrible. I don't think you know how much I love Rookie. I mean, the only reason we don't need to break up is because I don't have a chance with Rookie. But like, if I had a chance with Rookie, if I had a chance with Rookie, you're fucking gone. You're gone. <laughs> you're fucking gone in a second if I had a chance with him. All right, what are we doing? Are we banning Azir? Are we keeping Varus banned? What are we doing? Rookie gets a Talia ban. Do we ban Azir? Do we ban Azir? Do we ban Azir? Do we ban Rakan? Maybe. I think that the way it works is if they first pick Rakan, then we go Azir. So we leave both up. Oh, we just banned the Varus, I guess? Maybe we banned Nautilus? Actually, what is the plan? They banned the Azir, and now Nautilus and Rakan are both up. Okay, that's the angle. Varus per first pick? F*** it, bro. Take Rakan. Is it just Rakan Maokai? Because Ash is up, but I think you just- I think you're just willing to play into it, no? Like, Rakan has been so OP in this series. I think we just take Rakan. Nah, really? Hmm. Hmm. Is it just a rookie Orianna game? Rek'Sai is also up. I mean, I think that honestly, W could probably blind the Rek'Sai and there wouldn't be much counterplay. But if you blind Rek'Sai, then Fofo will probably get banned out. So I guess we'll see. Senna, Nautilus. And Photic was one of the best Senna players in China. So do we get a Rakan here? Honestly, if I'm WE, I would just go Rakan Rek'Sai. <laughs> I would just go Rakan Rek'Sai. I mean, the Rek'Sai looks so unbeatable. And I would just drop mid lane. Let Fofo get banned out. He can play Karma, Huey, Oriana, whatever. It's been so, like, that's what I would draft, personally, because it's just been so good in the series. I would just pick champions that are, like, good in the series, and they work, like, pretty decently together. What did I say? What did I say? Renekton into, I don't know, bro, I don't know. Look at this game. It won five games, even though it's fifth seed versus ninth seed. Laughing my ass off, what a coincidence, right? Clearly not. This is most likely match fixed. It is a shame that members of the league community okay with match fixing and ruining competitive integrity. I will dominate is definitely responsible for this money making LPL China Chinese triad scheme. He broke up with his girlfriend, so he d definitely would run a match fixing organization in conjunction, in conjunction with the triads. I really hope Riot Freak can investigate this. What is Fofo gonna play? It's just gonna be like Huey Maokai or something? It's just gonna be like Huey Maokai. There's the Huey. Where's the Oriana, bro? But like, who's killing this Rek'Sai, dude? Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Don't do Corky. No, 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 no. Please, no. Please, no. Please, no. Please, no. Please, please, please. I'm down. I'm so down with A-Soul. I've been wanting to see Rookie's A-Soul for such a long time. And finally, we get it. I'm down. I'm down. I'm down. That was like the only pick that could save this shit. Okay. Let's go, rookie. Hey, they're getting free Drake. I guess you're okay with this, though. You kind of are down to give Drake here on, like, first Drake. Sucks that it's a mountain, but it is what it is. All right, so Wayward ended up forced to TP. Shanji TPs as well. He's just buying armor this time. Like, is that the tech, bro? Do you just buy armor into Rex? Like, I don't know, bro. I don't know what the tech is. I don't know how you play anything. Votic has no flash. Is he just dead? Votic's in trouble. Rookie ended up bolting, didn't get anything off of it. You can flex Rek'Sai into the jungle. I think you can, but it's a very specific the games you can do it. This guy is beyond dead ball lane. Actually, maybe he's not. Maybe he can just clear the whole wave. Wow, he actually clears the wave here. Oh, huge! He's level 6, stays dead! Let's go! Let's go, NIP! Let's go! We needed that, bro. We needed Stay to just run it down. Joe just, like, one-shot that wave. Hit level 6, he wasn't expecting it. Does Rookie have, uh, Rylai's yet? He probably does, right? Pretty cheap item. Yeah, Riley's already completed for Rookie. Okay, nice. Drake in one minute. I think this is a contest. No flash on Hang. Aren't you gonna get Dove here? He should be okay. They have a uh, they have Senna ult here. Can we get a TP from anyone? Just wants to be under towers. That is his game plan oh, today. good buffer from Wayward. Uh, Wayward, Wayward is smart. He ulted the stun. It's actually really good play by them. Well, the thing I like about Aesol is Aesol is actually a champion that can kill a Rek'Sai. Like, Q from Aesol kills tanks. It's like one of the few champions that can actually do enough consistent damage to murder a Rek'Sai or an Udyr. The Rylai slow is also really good, so I think the, the Aesol pick kind of saved the draft. New Herald. Rookie's level 11 here. Okay, it's fightable. Fightable. As they muscle their way into the river, Wayward moves in the top side of the play. That's a lot of percent damage. Okay, they get Wayward's flash. Is Aki forced to flash? Aki, you got a flash. Steal here, but he's alone. Flash out of the play. I wonder he gets out of there. The comet comes down, but it doesn't achieve anything. Once again, we see NIP being a little. I don't like how it's looking for NIP, bro. That was the big ult too. So now rookie has no big ult for third Drake. I mean, Leandre's is the big spike for him. 
but he's behind because Fofo got 57 plates top lane. I mean, the question here is can like Renekton flank and get on to stay, but I just, I feel like Yes, Renekton I, has not I, been I able totally to saying, that that flank like Shanji has not been able to f find flanks all series. Late game barn burner. Joe has no flash. He's just dead. Actually, maybe they can fight it. They can turn. Oh, on to stay? Renekton? Can Renekton get a flank? Oh my god, Renekton's just one shot, bro. I don't know, Azel like doesn't have ult. Like he doesn't have big ult. The NIP frontline just can't deal with the damage coming out of WE in the early game. Yeah, the center and the Azel. Oh, oh, oh. But I don't think it's enough. It saved Fotik though. It kept them from going any deeper. Ain't no way, bro. All right, they lose mid turret. They lose Drake. Understandably so. This Azel. I don't know, man. I don't know. I just don't see how they win later on. Maybe Rookie just pulls some magic out of his ass, but like, it seems so hard to play. Like, who's gonna kill the front line? I mean, it's gotta be Aesol, but Aesol's not ahead. Rookie has super ult for this fight. Okay, they're ulting onto Joe. Okay, good flank from Shanji finally. He got the flash. Gotta back out though. Oh, Foda got knocked in. Who knocked him in? Wait, what happened? Who knocked Fodic in? Was that rookie or like what happened here? How did Fodic get knocked in? Did he auto? Like what happened, bro? Also, like, are we just giving it? We're not contesting? Out of position in that one. It means that oh my out. god, bro. Oh, we literally lose the game because of this blast cone thing. Like, that's the, like, if they can't win these fights, I don't know. I mean, I don't know how they're gonna win. Lost a bunch of flashes here, too. Okay. Gameplay. Wow, never mind. Yeah, it's just unplayable. Oh! Rookie! Rookie! One for one, though, right now. It's one for one. I mean, they killed Stay. They got his flash. Not bad. That's his big ult, though. Oh, they're going? Okay, they're not going. I saw Rookie just flying into the turret. They hang is just beating Aki's ass. Aki's in such a weird position. Don't they just send it on Aki here? I feel like I think I think they should just send it on Aki. We. Hey, Rookie's trying to drift. Hey, they go into Hang. I mean, Hang gets ult though. Hang ulted Aki. I don't feel like they can win, bro. I just feel like they can't win. Oh. Oh, Soul is actually pretty big in this game too. Does Rookie have Void here? He always goes Void instead of Crypt Bloom. He just loves Void. Wayward is actually getting caught. Wayward's caught. Okay. Okay, Wayward caught. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. Go Baron, bro. I think you have to, no? Just just do it. Just do it. Just do it. Just do it. Only one frontliner left in the form of this trundle, and NIP now have the chance to go towards the Baron. The ASOL continue just breathe death on the Baron and try and burn it down. They do this so quickly. Oh, they're just gonna kill the Nautilus, aren't they? Okay, onto Fofo. Oh, good fear from Fofo. Okay, but they're kind of sectioned off. They're on the run. Rookie big ult here. Okay. Okay, hang flash too. Free Baron. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. My goat. No, no, no. Kill, kill them and then go Baron. It's better. It's better. What they did is good. Chase them to the ends of the earth. You got a uh, flash from stay. I mean, they have, there's no rookie big ult now, but it's definitely like good. Chanji flashed on Fofo last fight though, and he didn't even get anything off of it. Like the elder fight is actually really hard. A minute and 15 seconds for elder. I mean, there's no flash on stay, but there's no flash on Renekton and rookie has no big ult. So it's like, it's pretty even fight to be honest. I really hope the NIP can like leverage the Baron on the waves. This shit's stressing me out, bro. Wayward. Desperate to keep their playoff streams alive. I mean, Rookie's actually Rise dealing damage to him. Ever got as an organization away with forced away by Rookie on the A soul. Drake about to spot. I want him. You teleport back in. But I want him dead. I want him dead. It's a huge pick. Chanji got on onto Fofo. It's one. Oh, wait, wait, wait. He's getting one shot, bro. What the?
Oh my god, the 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 Aesol! GG, end it, end it, end it, end it. They can end mid, no? Holy Quadra from Rookie! Holy my goat! Quadra kill for the mid laner. Damn. Mid Thank you, Wayward. You Thank you, brother Wayward. Smolder. No, no. This is the year of Aesol. First Nexus Tower in trouble. Wayward gets What's happening? Can they finish the kill? What's happening? The health bars down to half a Wait, did he just save the game? Did Wayward just save the game after running it? Okay, go Elder. Go. Wait, can they even go Elder? Oh, it's not over. It's not over. It's not over. It's not over. Oh, shit. But I mean, he, he like, that was the fight without his big ult. He has big ult soon. In the next one, he has it. And he's got like almost death cap. Come on, rookie. Come on, rookie. Even the top esports roster not working out. Aki. Aki, I swear to fucking god, if you run it. Rookie, he saved his ult there. He saved his ult. It is, but that's the Trundle and the Varasol. Two very important tools. No ults really used on this side of NIP. Big, big, big. Big for NIP. They got this. They got this. That might just be enough in itself. Rookie. Wayward has no flash. Rookie is in good position. Who's he gonna find? Rakan is ult now, though. Rakan is ult. We have to make sure we mark Rakan. Come on. Rookie's trying to change his angle. He's going to go from the back. Oh, Shanji, bro. Shanji, man. Wait, is he going to get ulted? Shanji has no, no TP. Wait, is Rookie dead? No! 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 Oh, no! Oh, my God. He eat the dragon here. No! 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 Bro, please. No, man. Oh, my God. They're getting executed. Please, dude. Please. Make it stop. Make it f***ing stop. They're losing their base, by the way, but it doesn't matter. Oh, they're going to get Baron with this. Oh, no. That was Rookie's big ult, too. Okay, Rookie. How long for his first big ult, man? doesn't feel like it's there half right now. It's like Wandy, though. Chunked. Photic, by the way, is full build on this lethality center. Got on to stay? Okay, stay is out. Oh, look at the E, bro. Look at the E. From Ruggie, bro. No one can play. Okay. That's not good. Big ult from Rookie, though. Big ult from Rookie. Fofo, no flash. Oh, Joe didn't hit. Going on to Rookie. Okay. Rookie flashes it. Joe is dead. Ult missed. Ult missed from uh, Hong. Where's the big ult from Rookie? There's the big ult. What's happening? Rookie has no ult. Wayward's looking to flank. Wayward's got a flank onto Rookie. Back to almost full HP. It's a reset. And it's Come on. From the front line okay, yes, 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 yes. It's over, it's over, it's over, it's over. Is Holy rookie one. All of that. God bless, bro. God bless. Wait, they're trying to end mid? Okay, yeah, fine, 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 end mid. Whatever, just, just end anywhere, bro. They get the elder, but can they get the wave into the enemy base? Let's go! Let's it. go! Aki hits those. Dude, I thought he missed it, bro. I thought he missed it. I thought he missed it. Thank God. God bless. My f***ing goat rookie. Dude, Shanji was absolutely worthless this series. He got gapped by Wayward so f***ing hard. He got gapped so hard.